you can now apply all of your Microsoft Purview solutions, such as DLP, eDiscovery, information barriers, and data lifecycle to all those files inside of Zoom or Microsoft Teams. What if you had a DLP policy that says, hey, all financial information is not allowed to be sent, like ABA routing numbers or credit card numbers. And since you're using SharePoint as a file repository, all those DLP policies will apply to all the files inside of that SharePoint site. And since Zoom is using that SharePoint site for a file repository, that DLP policy will apply to Zoom. So for example, say Bob in accounting creates an Excel spreadsheet, accidentally puts a whole bunch of customer credit card information in it and tries to send it in Zoom, not gonna happen. Microsoft Purview will see that policy get hit because it's trying to send an Excel file inside of SharePoint and therefore all those policies that you have in Microsoft Purview apply to all those files inside of Zoom. Same thing with eDiscovery and email. Since we're using Zoom to connect to Microsoft Exchange, all of those policies from Microsoft Purview that are eDiscovery policies apply to Exchange on the email side. So therefore Zoom will honor all those policies inside of the Zoom client.